Hello Lindhurst. Now it's either good morning or good afternoon, depending on when you're watching this assembly. Um, I've snuck into Yarra room because it's lovely and quiet in here today. So shh, don't tell Miss Harwood. Um, anyway, we're here to talk about the assembly, the, the seal theme, what we're thinking about, what our theme of the week is about. And this week we're looking at waiting for what you want. Now, waiting for what you want makes me think of something's coming to you. You're waiting for something, um, maybe it's a gift, maybe it's your birthday and you're waiting for something to arrive. Um, some of you might have to wait a short time for something, others might have to wait a long time. So for instance, my birthday is in April. So I'm, I've am i got a couple, two or three months to wait and then it's my birthday. Those of you who've got your birthday in the summer holidays or, or September, October, you've got quite a bit longer to wait. So sometimes when we wait for something, it arrives quickly, other times it takes a bit longer. Um, sometimes it might be on the day now, you might know that um, today's Monday, so hmm, every Monday you might have a delicious milkshake when you get home, maybe that's your treat. So you know you're going to get that when you get home. Um, hmm, milkshake, I wonder what your favorite flavor is. Uh, now, not all things have to be a physical gift or a physical thing, a material thing. Sometimes you might be waiting for something really special, like a hug, or you might be waiting for daddy to come home and tickle you, or read you a book, read you your favorite book, things like that. So they're not always something that you can unwrap and, and use. Um, I know a lot of you are probably not seeing your grandparents or family members and friends. I know you haven't seen them for a long, long, long time. Now, that's a really special thing that you're waiting for. I know I've got lots of family I haven't seen. Um, a lot of my friends haven't seen their family. We know what it's like. It's really, really hard waiting for that moment when you can see them and hug them and just tell them how much you love them is a really special thing. But we have to be something. We have to be, yes, patient. We have to be patient. It's hard. It's really hard being patient because sometimes you want it and you want it now. Even us adults feel like that at times. You know, you want something and you want it now. We have to learn to be patient and we have to understand the true meaning of what we're waiting for and understand that just sometimes we have to wait. So what I'd really like you to do is to have a conversation with your families, somebody at home, have a conversation about what it is that you're waiting for. Um, what are they waiting for? Uh, who's gonna get theirs kind of quicker? Who has to wait a bit longer? Have that type of conversation and see if you can not just talk about, you know, yeah, I'm waiting for my new game to arrive or whatever. Try and have a think about what kind of act of kindness you're waiting for or what lovely special thing that happens at home you're waiting for. I hope that makes sense. Have a good conversation with your families. Have a great week and see you next week when we'll talk about the next week's theme. Bye bye.